Deep in the Siberian wilderness lies Oymyakon, a remote village in Russia. Known as the Pole of Cold, it holds the record for the lowest temperature ever recorded in a permanently inhabited place. This temperature, a bone-chilling minus 71.2 degrees Celsius, which is minus 96.2 degrees Fahrenheit, was recorded in 1924. Oymyakon is a testament to the resilience of the human spirit, where people have adapted to survive and thrive in conditions most would find unimaginable. Oymyakon's extreme cold results from a combination of geographic factors. This remote village, often referred to as the coldest inhabited place on Earth, experiences temperatures that can plummet to minus 50 degrees Celsius, or even lower. But what exactly makes it so cold here? Located in a valley in the heart of Siberia, the village is far from the moderating influences of oceans. This isolation means that there are no large bodies of water nearby to help regulate the temperature. The surrounding mountains also play a crucial role, trapping cold air in the valley and preventing warmer air from moving in. Its high elevation of about 750 meters, or 2,460 feet above sea level, further contributes to the frigid temperatures. At this altitude, the air is thinner and holds less heat, which means that the ground loses heat more quickly during the long winter nights. During winter, which lasts from November to March, the sun barely rises above the horizon, resulting in long periods of darkness. This lack of sunlight means that there is very little solar energy to warm the ground and the air. The long shadows cast by the low sun also mean that any heat that does reach the ground is quickly lost. The lack of sunlight combined with the region's high pressure systems creates ideal conditions for extreme cold to settle in. These high pressure systems are characterized by clear skies and calm winds, which allow the ground to radiate heat away into the atmosphere. Without clouds to trap the heat, the temperature drops rapidly, creating the bone-chilling cold that Oymyakon is known for. The combination of these factors makes Oymyakon one of the most inhospitable places on Earth, where survival requires incredible resilience and adaptation. Despite the harsh conditions, Oymyakon is home to a small but resilient community of around 500 people, primarily indigenous Evens and Yakuts. These hardy individuals have managed to carve out a life in one of the coldest inhabited places on Earth, where temperatures can plummet to minus 50 degrees Celsius or lower. The village, nestled in the heart of Siberia, is a testament to human endurance and adaptability. These communities have lived in the region for centuries, adapting their lifestyles to withstand the extreme cold. The Evans and Yakuts have developed unique cultural practices and traditions that are deeply intertwined with their environment. Their clothing, made from reindeer hides and other natural materials, is designed to provide maximum warmth and protection against the biting cold. Over generations they have honed their skills in crafting garments that are both functional and beautiful, reflecting their rich cultural heritage. Life in Oymyakon revolves around traditional practices, with reindeer herding, hunting, and fishing forming the backbone of their subsistence economy. Reindeer are not only a source of food, but also provide materials for clothing and tools. Hunting in the dense snowy forest requires patience and expertise, while fishing on the frozen rivers demands ingenuity and resilience. These activities are not just means of survival but are also integral to the community's identity and way of life. The people of Oymyakon have a deep connection to their land and a strong sense of community, relying on each other for survival in this unforgiving environment. Community gatherings are a vital part of life here where stories are shared and traditions are passed down through generations. In times of need the villagers come together, helping each other with tasks that are essential for survival. This spirit of cooperation and mutual support is what enables them to thrive in such a harsh climate. Their resilience and unity are a powerful reminder of the strength of the human spirit in the face of adversity. Daily life in Oymyakon is a constant battle against the elements. The extreme cold affects every aspect of life from transportation and communication to basic necessities like water and sanitation. Cars are often left running throughout the day to prevent the engine oil from freezing. Schools are closed if the temperature drops below minus 52 degrees Celsius or minus 61.6 degrees Fahrenheit. Even simple tasks like going to the store or fetching water require careful planning and preparation to avoid frostbite. Section 5. The Challenges of Extreme Cold 
Living in such extreme cold presents numerous challenges. Frostbite and hypothermia are constant threats, requiring residents to dress in layers of warm clothing and limit their time outdoors. The frozen ground makes construction difficult, and most buildings are built on stilts to prevent thawing the permafrost. Growing crops is impossible, so the community relies on a diet heavy in meat, fish, and dairy products. The isolation of Oymyakon also poses challenges with limited access to healthcare and other essential services. Section 6. Why Oymyakon? Reasons for staying. Given the hardships, one might wonder why people choose to live in Oymyakon. For many residents, the answer lies in their deep ancestral roots in the region. The land has sustained their families for generations and they are unwilling to abandon their heritage. Others are drawn to the economic opportunities provided by reindeer herding, hunting, and tourism. Section 7. The Spirit of Oymyakon, Resilience and Adaptation The people of Oymyakon embody resilience and adaptation. They have developed unique strategies for coping with the extreme cold, from their traditional clothing and housing to their resourceful use of natural resources. Their deep understanding of the environment and their ability to adapt to its challenges are a testament to the enduring spirit of humanity. Section 8. Interesting Facts About Oymyakon Nestled deep in the Siberian wilderness, Oymyakon is one of the coldest inhabited places on Earth. This remote village is a testament to human resilience and adaptability. Oymyakon is a place of fascinating contrasts and unique characteristics. The village experiences some of the most extreme weather conditions, with temperatures plummeting to as low as minus 67.7 degrees Celsius, minus 89.9 degrees Fahrenheit. This makes it one of the coldest permanently inhabited locations on the planet. Here are some interesting facts about this extraordinary village. The name Oymyakon means unfrozen water, referring to a nearby hot spring that remains unfrozen even in the harshest winters. This natural wonder is a stark contrast to the otherwise frozen landscape. The ground is permanently frozen, a phenomenon known as permafrost. This permafrost affects every aspect of life in Oymyakon, from construction to agriculture. Buildings are constructed on stilts to prevent the heat from the structures from melting the permafrost, which could cause them to sink. Cars are often left running all day to prevent the engine oil from freezing. In such extreme cold, starting a car that has been turned off can be nearly impossible. Residents have adapted by using special engine heaters and keeping their vehicles in heated garages whenever possible. There are no indoor plumbing systems due to the risk of frozen pipes. Instead, residents use outdoor toilets, which can be quite a challenge in the freezing temperatures. Water is fetched from nearby rivers and wells, and is stored in large containers inside homes to prevent it from freezing. The village has only one hotel which attracts adventurous tourists from around the world. These visitors come to experience the extreme cold and the unique way of life in Oymyakon. The hotel provides basic amenities and a warm refuge from the harsh outside conditions. Despite the cold, the residents of Oymyakon have a warm and welcoming culture. They are known for their hospitality and resilience. Traditional Yakutian cuisine, which includes dishes like stroganina, frozen raw fish, and reindeer meat, is a staple in their diet. The community often comes together for festivals and celebrations, showcasing their rich cultural heritage. Living in such an extreme environment has fostered a strong sense of community and mutual support among the villagers. Section 9. Oymyakon in a Changing World Climate change is impacting even the most remote corners of the globe, and Oymyakon is no exception. The region is experiencing rising temperatures and thawing permafrost, threatening the traditional way of life. These changes present both challenges and opportunities for the community as they navigate the uncertainties of a changing climate. Section 10. Conclusion. A testament to human adaptability. Oymyakon stands as a testament to human adaptability and the enduring spirit of those who call this frozen land home. Their resilience in the face of extreme cold, their deep connection to their land and their unique culture offer valuable lessons for us all. As the world grapples with the challenges of climate change, the story of Oymyakon serves as a reminder of the importance of adaptation, community, and respect for the natural world. Section 11. Visiting Oymyakon, a journey to the coldest inhabited place. 
For the adventurous traveler, a visit to Oimiyakon offers a unique opportunity to experience life in one of the most extreme environments on Earth. From witnessing the breathtaking beauty of the frozen landscape to interacting with the resilient people who call it home, a journey to Oimyakon is an unforgettable experience. However, it is essential to be well prepared for the extreme conditions and to approach the local culture with respect and sensitivity.